Hi, I'm Mark Charles. This is the New Mexico Minute. Today we're talking about party time. Being a justice of the peace in old New Mexico would be hazardous to the health or a source of popularity, depending on how justice was dispensed. One JP, who had presided over the trial of three minors charged with killing a man while they were drunk, imposed a fine of $5,000 on each of the defendants. Their friends thought the fines excessive, so they formed a lynch mob, got a rope, and marched on the justice's home, intending to invite him to a necktie party. After considering all of his options, he resigned his position and left town just as the mob was releasing the prisoners. Justice Jack Jenkins' courtroom in Bluesburg was also frequently mobbed by people wanting to witness his hearings. Jenkins regularly fined prisoners a keg of beer, which everyone, including the accused, was invited to share. It, if arrests were frequent and the beer was plentiful, he would change the fine to $5 worth of cheese and crackers. Then after the judicial proceedings had been completed and all the fines paid, the festivities would begin, which no doubt resulted in further fines and festivities.